First thing again is setting up the problem correctly. First thing I'm going to do, I'm not going to actually set it equal to 0 because if I know if I set it equal to 0, my 0 is going to be negative 3. Then I take the coefficients of all my terms, make sure this is in the descending order. I do not have an x cubed, so I need to include a 0. Does everybody follow? Yes. Okay. First term, bring down. Easy. One, multiply on the diagonal. 1 times negative 3 is negative 3. 0 plus negative 3 is negative 3. Negative 3, negative 3 times negative 3 is going to be a positive 9. 3 plus 9 is 12. 12 times negative 3 is negative 36. 1 plus negative 36 is negative 35. Negative 35 times negative 3 is going to be a positive 105. 105 plus 4 is 109. So to label this, that is my remainder, my constant, my linear, my quadratic, and my cubic. Please remember to take whatever your remainder is over your divisor when you're writing your final answer. So the final answer is 